when he feels good. It's just a little older. Uh, but then afterwards, you know, it gets a little stiff. But, you know, I think with that last week, um, last week in practicing, I think that was really good for him because uh, his foot held up. And, um, you know, this week, I think it should be even better. It's game time, uh, I, I think he'll be tuned up. Tough news about Jason, but you have the ability to drop down into the box. We've seen you do that before. Tevin's big. How does having two big safeties kind of help with the loss of Jason? Um, well, in that sense, it helps just because, um, you know, either one of our safeties, like you said, can go down in the box um, and on, you know, certain plays almost be like an extra backer. Uh, whereas if, you know, we're both smaller, faster guys that, you know, can't come down, you know, in the box, that could kind of present a problem as far as uh, losing Jason. But, I mean, I think uh, with our size, you know, both of us will be able to uh, uh, come down and help when we need to. How important is it to win the turnover battle? That's huge. Uh, you know, when we don't turn it over, you know, we can usually win. And, you know, anytime we cause a turnover, uh, that's momentum for our team right there. Uh, and our offense has been, uh, you know, good about capitalizing on that. And Coach Wood always preaches it. I don't know the exact stat, but winning that um, is a huge key and component to winning the game. It was obviously a step up in competition from the first two games of the year. I mean, how excited are you to, to show on the road, national television, that those two games were legit? Uh, I'm, I'm really excited, you know. Uh, Michigan's a great opponent. Uh, like I was telling them, this game, you know, it's, it's going to go four quarters. Um, you know, I don't force, foresee any team wanting to give this game up. So it's going to, people are going to be slugging it out. And, um, you know, I'm excited. You know, we, our team, we talk about this, what we want. And, you know, this is a huge game for us to show, uh, you know, what we're about and really go get what we want. Is their loss to Notre Dame and the way they lost, and they really, they really haven't beaten anybody significant yet. Is this game lost a little cachet than maybe when you looked at it a year or so ago? No, not at all. Um, you know, teams have good and bad weeks. Um, and, you know, last week against Miami, um, they looked really strong. Uh, you know, and they definitely bounced back from no the Notre Dame game. But, uh, you know, for us as a team, uh, you know, we can't take them lightly because of them two weeks ago because, you know, we're playing them Saturday. And, you know, just for us, we want to come and have a good game every week. So uh, just because they have one bad game, you know, you can't really uh, let that shake up your mindset. You could fit like two and a half right cycles into, into the big house. Uh, you like playing? I mean, it's maybe almost like a once in a lifetime chance to play in front of a crowd that big. What is that? How does that get you pumped up? That's exciting. Uh, you know, all of our team I know is excited. To, uh, you know, just to be able to go to the big house. I don't think any of us have ever been there. Um, and you know, it's going to be a huge crowd. But um, you know, I think. Uh, as a team, you know, once we know what we got to do, so uh, we can admire it the day before uh, during warm up, seeing the big crowd. But you know, once the game starts, it's just uh, you know, it's just us in between those yard lines. So uh, you know, I don't foresee that you know being too big of a deal. But it's it's a big crowd. You know, it's fun to win in front of a big crowd. Michigan's often praised for being big and physical. As a guy that prides himself in physical play. How much do you relish the opportunity to prove how physical you guys can be? I'm excited about it. Um, you know, I was telling them, um, you know, watching Michigan play, it was exciting for me because, um, you know, either one of us, me or Tevin, we're going to get a come down. Uh, and, you know, I think just get more action as far as, you know, just making tackles in the run, uh, taking on the offensive linemen, just things like that, uh, which you don't get to do as much against spread teams, you know, teams that just want to spread you out and air it out. So. Uh, you know, and just as a whole, you know, the D I'm excited to see the D line, the linebackers, uh, you know, meet their powerful offensive front. So it it's going to be fun. What do you see out of Devin Gardner, kind of a dual threat type guy? Uh, I see a quarterback who's, uh, you know, really comfortable in his system. Uh, I mean, you know, he can run the heck out of the ball, he can throw it super far. Um, but, you know, I. Watching him the last few weeks, I don't uh, see him trying to do too much. You know, he, he's he's good with the system. Uh, you know, when he has to, he can make those plays. Uh, but, you know, he trusts his guys to make plays. And he's got, uh, you know, a ton of good backs. He's got a big line. And, you know, even all his receivers, even uh, without fun just last week, they all stepped up and, uh, you know, they were clicking. You were one of the holdovers.
Bears from the Mountain West days, this game would have been, uh, you know, the marquee game on the schedule, maybe outside of BYU. But uh, how has that changed now that you're in the Pac-12? Do you look at this as still, you know, a huge measuring stick for the program? Um, I mean, for me, you know, I look as, uh, you know, the whole season as a measuring stick. So, you know, this is a big game. Um, but, you know, this is what we want. We want um, to play those top teams, and, you know, we want to start beating those top teams. So, um, you know, uh, you got to do it week in and week out. So, you know, Michigan's a huge game. Um, but, you know, the goal is to go in there, get that one done, and then look at next week and play whoever's next. So, um, and like you said, you know, there's Pac 12's full of good teams this year. So, um, you know, it's a big game, but especially being the first road game. I'm excited to go on the road, but it's not, you know, just the only game we're looking at.